<laughs> playing. Hey, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Serene, and today's book review is a um pretty big family series. Um, this series, I believe I told you in one of the other videos about Miss Tina Martin. This is the first series um that hooked me to her. And then made me venture into all the other books she had at the time. And still today, I keep up with her and read and purchase all her new books when they come out. Um, and that is um, the Alexander family. Uh, the Millionaire's Arranged Marriage. The second book is Watch Me Take Your Girl. This book number three is her premarital ex. Book number four is the object of obses obsession. The object of his obsession. That's book four. Book five. Book five is his charity challenge. Dale Vaughn's redemption. Book six is Dale Vaughn's redemption. Book seven is different taste. It is as long as we got love. So, okay. The Alexander family have some serious issues in it. Deep issues in their family that you basically read as they work out within them. And um, some of the ways it was worked out, I can agree with. And in other ways... I don't agree with them, <laughs> but it's still some good read. It's also the perfect example that everybody deal with stuff differently. And just because you may deal with something one way don't mean another person won't, will deal with it in that same way. They might deal with it another way. Or just because something is serious and deep to you doesn't necessarily mean it's serious and deep to somebody else. But um, it's still... It was it's some good real life family stuff that's going on in these books and um like I say um it's dramatic <laughs> very dramatic so um yeah I enjoyed all eight books all eight of them um and I enjoyed every character and um uh, it just hit on a lot of different things um, to me, it hits a little bit on the domestic violence. It hits a little bit into the mental um, mental issues people can have and go undiagnosed. Undiagnosed. Right, because a lot of people like to pretend their family don't have a um, mental issue going in it. And when we all know, a lot of times they do. But they want to act like, oh, well, it's nothing or... It's not a big deal where they know right from wrong and blah, blah, blah. The bottom line is somebody that got mental illness need more help than only the prayer. They need a little more than that. They need the prayer, but they need a little extra help with the prayer. Okay? For mental health. And um, a lot of people try to deny that. <laughs> um, I also... It also taps into uh, to loyalty um, with family members. To what extent um, is your loyalty should or is with your family? And um, love. It deals with the love, too. I, I mean, it deals with a lot through these eight books. Fears um, that people have to get over and deal with. Um, all kinds of um trust issues. Uh, one of the characters reminded me of myself when it um came to learning how to trust to let people back into your life. And I'm not talking about like a um trusting a man, me trusting a man to um be back in my life. People, period, family. <laughs> All that trusting them in your life, or that you know that's around and know 
secrets and um you know it can be painful when you have a family member misuse your trust or break the trust you have for them because your family is supposed to be the one group you should be able to be yourself no matter what that is around and um not worry about them exploiting it or running around um discussing you behind your back to everybody in the world or talking about you or putting you down or lying on you you know you you shouldn't to me you shouldn't have to watch your back when it comes to your family basically that's what i'm trying to get out and uh yeah this book touch on all of the subjects above i just named it talks about all of that so if you into some dramatics this um the alexander's family series definitely has it for you in all kind of different ways <laughs> it has it for you okay so um get into it so um yeah go ahead and give the alexander family a try because once again like i said it, all our book all eight books were great and even though i may not agree with all the endings of what happened and how they solve certain issues um it doesn't take away from the fact that they are great books to read and um these this is a series i have read multiple times yes the whole thing so yeah um give it a try get into it i think you would love it especially if you're for the dramatics okay so um if you made it to the end of my video thank you and um go, don't forget to subscribe click on that thumbs up for a like hit that notification bell so you can be um reminded every time i upload a video and thank you for um listening and um hopefully give the books a try because tina martin is an amazing african-american writer and you definitely should um get into her so thank you